I'm Larry Anglesano from Aviation Consumer Magazine. Avidon says it's closer to certification and delivery of its IFD 540 GPS. That's a slide-in navigator for Garmin's GNS 530W. I recently caught up with Avidon's Tom Harper at Sun and Fun back in April to get an update on the project. We're at Sun and Fun 2014, and uh, this is kind of coming down the home stretch with our certification on the IFD 540, which is Avidon's FMS GPS Navcom. And uh, we're uh, taking folks up and getting some flight demos here and getting some airtime uh, with the box and allowing uh, folks to uh, actually use it in the air and, and in the airspace. And uh, it's got some really nice features that include the page and tab user interface that really makes it easy to navigate through the box and make it much simpler to operate. Nice features like uh, the pre-programmed channels you can cycle through and, and auto-tune in, into the uh, Com radio, uh, multiple standby frequencies, the ability to monitor those standby frequencies with the, the Avidyne audio panel, the, uh, the ability to drive the Avidyne AXP340 transponder for ADSB out compliance, uh, combined to make the IFD540 a really formidable challenger in this market space, and we're really looking forward to bringing it to market. For current owners of GNS 530s, this is a quick plug-and-play replacement to get to an IFD 540. Literally pull into the shop, it can, the unit can be pulled out, the 540 can be dropped in and programmed, and you can. Uh, it's really a fly-by upgrade. It, it, it makes it nice and easy. And the IFD 540 also has the ability to interface with all the other sensors in the airplane, including uh, XM or an Avidyne MLB 700 for data link weather. Any of the traffic systems, the popular traffic systems uh, that are available today, including Avidyne's TAS 600 series, and it has a uh, terrain alerting system integrated into the 540, or it'll, it can also be a TAS B. We're still, like I said, in the home stretch of certification. We hope to be uh, shipping hopefully by the end of the quarter, or the end of June, and uh, looking forward to uh, an exciting rest of 2014. You can read about Avidyne's IFD 540 in the May 2014 issue of Aviation Consumer Magazine. Reporting for Aviation Consumer, I'm Larry Anglosano. Thanks for watching. All right, let me know when we're rolling. Can you can you do that in a short bit? Can you do that in like maybe ten minutes? Not easy being us.